video is going to be about how to make a stress ball. It's totally off topic, but I, but I might do it now and then. This video will include the basics, the basic needs and some additional things to make it look pretty. I hope you enjoy this video. Okay, let's get started. You'll need a balloon, the bigger the better. At the end of this video, I will show you what your balloon should and shouldn't look like. You will need a small cup of water. Please be careful not to overfill it because the contents will come bursting out. Trust me, I've had experience. If you have some stray form beads, it will give you the nice texture and feeling when you squeeze it. Then get a tissue or paper towel and draw in text on it. Put as much colour as you want and any sh shade. I want an orange colour in mine, so I'm using oranges, yellows and pinks. the balloon with the help of a pen or a thin blunt smooth stick if you have that. Put in the water then carefully with something wide underneath, put some of the stray form beads inside. It should be filled up to halfway. Then for the last bit, you, if you put a lot of paper towel or stray form, I suggest less water. If you don't have much of the filling inside, you can increase the water by 2%. Be very careful with, with tying the balloon. If you don't know how to, ask an adult to tie it. Tie the knot as high as you can so there's enough space for the water to move around and it won't burst as soon as you squeeze it. Please do not try to use a rubber band because slowly you won't notice it but the water will slowly leak out. Trust me, I've, I've had experience with this as well. Here I'm showing you what I've made. The first one is the one we made together. You will have to squeeze it for, for the colour to reveal a bit more. Next is a silver balloon which releases a kind of dark green colour. If I squeeze one end, I can feel a strange vibration. Can anybody explain that? The next one is one of my favourites. No colour but, but sparkly confetti inside. one that is tied to the lot. The next one is rose pink. The colour came when I was eating pomegranate and my fingers were covered in juice. So I wiped my hands on a tissue and days later, I came up with the idea. The last one is kind of the same version as our one, but in a soft amber colour instead. Okay, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. See you soon. Bye.